Hello, nice to have you with us on the Barbecue Walk of Flame. And today I'm cooking a sensation on the side. Hasselback sweet potatoes with burnt onion butter. When it comes to a side dish, this one is the barbecuer's best friend. It takes just 20 to 30 minutes to cook and will happily sit on the warming rack whilst its partner on the plate gets a grilling. To Hasselback the potatoes, I'm going to make a series of slits cut into the potato with wires about two centimeters apart. Here's a tip to prevent those slits becoming slices. With two wooden spoons laid down on my cutting board and a sweet potato placed between them, cut down and the spoons prevent the knife from going all the way through. These potatoes are quite firm so I'm using a gentle rocking motion to make the slits. And that's the potatoes all nicely hassleback. Take a sheet of foil, place the potato in the centre and brush with oil. No need for olive oil, I'm using vegetable oil. Just make sure everything is coated. Now for a good grind of salt. To make a parcel, bring the edges of the foil together, fold over and scrunch. Then do the same with each end, scrunching together to make a seal. The thermometer on my Weber Q is off the scale and that's what I call hot. Place the parcels on the grill. The foil will retain moisture from the potatoes as it turns to steam. For the burnt onion butter, brush three salad onions with vegetable oil and place them on the grill. On this gorgeous summer's day, the smell of food cooking on the barbecue is competing with the scent of freshly mown grass. Turn the potatoes every 10 minutes and keep your eye on the onions. As you can see, they're charred on the one side and now for the other. While it's all cooking, I'll grate a half a clove of garlic. Well, I think they're charred enough, so let's get them off the grill. These onions need to be finely chopped, and this is the gadget to do it with. In the bowl I have 40 grams of softened butter. To this I'm adding the chopped onion, followed by a good handful of parsley together with about a teaspoon of thyme leaves, both from my herb garden and finely chopped. Then it's a half a teaspoon of smoked paprika mash it all together. Almost forgot the garlic. Brush it in and give it a mix. Finish off with a grind of salt and pepper, another stir and we're done. 
Time to get those potatoes off the grill. Open those parcels carefully. Yes, they are very hot. Fold back the foil to make a dish. Spread the burnt onion butter over the potatoes. Allowing it to melt its umami rich flavour into those slits. And that is Hasselback Sweet Potatoes with Burnt Onion Butter. If you'd like to know more about this dish, cooking on my Weber Q, or anything at all, all you have to do is click that button. Don't forget to activate and ding the bell, and leave your comment in the comments box below. Now, here's the recipe recap. That is one sensational side. Do have a go at this one at home. We enjoyed ours with barbecued chicken, salad and coleslaw.
if you've enjoyed this video then give us a thumbs up well that's all for now join me next time and see what's cooking on my Weber Q so from me the old geezer at the grill the dude with the food it's goodbye and thanks for watching Thank you.